All right, you guys, it's Amy here at Moment of Truth, and we have been getting a ton of calls about our shockwave and lots of clients asking about it. And I'm so excited because all of us here at the office have just been over the moon and constantly surprised at some of the amazing results we're getting. And so being in pelvic health, we're using it for a lot of things that um, I think we're the only pelvic PTs in Arizona using one right now. And so um, we're using it for a lot of things that aren't... Um, what's already been proven in mainstream. And so getting amazing results for C-section scars, um, endometriosis, PCOS, um, difficulties with fertility, horrible periods, excessive bleeding, things that women often feel stuck either going on hormones and birth control for that they might not want to, or surgeries, or there's just no answers, they're suffering, and it can be a really painful struggle. So Really excited. Today, we're going to demonstrate a treatment on the abdomen. Again, treating bladder issues, treating um, all of the things I just mentioned. We also have a whole protocol for improving climaxes and orgasms, as well as treating ED. So again, awesome thing about Shockwave is that there's no pain. There's no needles. There's no medication. There's no downtime. Working with a younger baseball player right now, you don't have to stop your sport necessarily or stop what you're doing. So it's been really great. People are really satisfied with it. I'm just gonna show you all the different pieces today. So this is the V-Actor. It's a massage head. It has vibration and sound. And so that has an impulse in there and we're able to change the rate that we use. Again, today we're gonna be treating the abdomen. And so typically whatever area we're treating, we're gonna use this throughout that area to bring blood flow, to relax the tissues in terms of sensation. Um, sometimes if people are in pain, obviously they're jumpy or guarded. And so this is just a bit more relaxing, help calm things, help them be prepared for the sensation that's coming with the wand. And so we typically do that for a couple of minutes first. So the particular shockwave machine we have also has this cupping function. Not all machines have that, so um, you can look for that at different locations. But um, what's great is we have the four different sizes. And so a lot of times if we're dealing with scar tissue or adhesions or want an additional tool to be able to bring blood flow to an area, this is really, really phenomenal. It's not quite like cupping you'd get in a massage, as you'll hear in just a minute. It's on a compressor, so it's a suction. It also has a slight hole in the side of each cup. That enables us to be able to cover the hole. You'll probably see in just a moment. That enables us to cover the hole if we wanna create additional suction and or let go. But you'll hear there's a pulse. We're able to also change um, how fast the pulse is and how strong um, within certain ranges. And so. Again, with the clitoral climax revelation. So again, with the climax revolution, we have, um, we use the smaller cup and are able to go up and around the labial tissue directly over the clitoris, over the top of where the mons pubis is area and bring more blood flow to that whole area, also down to the perineum. So phenomenal for tissue healing, phenomenal for dealing with scar tissue adhesions, anything going on that we can feel within the layers of the tissue. So you'll check that out now. So you can hear that noise and sort of the pulsing. And I can turn it all the way up. That's really fast. We don't typically like that. And so we can also use it with or without gel. So if it's without gel, you can see just on its own how much it's pulsing. And again, I mentioned that hole I can cover and pull up. Sometimes too much. I should have done more towards the center. Sorry, girl. Um, so again, we don't want to um, do that closer to bone. The tissue is just tighter. So uh, also more towards the ticklish area. So I'm able to just kind of pulse and move this across. If I'm really wanting to lift some of the different layers, I can add gel and glide back and forth across. And so that can also provide a slightly different sensation. Um, C-section scars often do better with the gel so that it just has more glide and a gentler feel to it. All right, so as you can see here, we have a lot of different tips that can go on the actual sound wave wand. Um, this here is um, has a silicone tip on it, really, really gentle for the base of the occiput, um, sometimes with the jaw, just different bony areas. We've used them on patellar fractures, um, things that are far more bony and sensitive. This is great for that. Um, the missing tip here is the one I have on to do her abdomen. So we're able to really customize it to the tissue we're reaching, 
the sensitivity of the client and what they're tolerating. So lots of options there. I'm going to put a little bit more gel. We're going to treat the abdomen right now. Give you an example. There's definitely a sensation to this wand. She's felt that before. So we're able to adjust the intensity and the variability for that. There's both a noise to it and a sensitivity and we can address both of those. We, we can't change the noise, but the sensitivity, which tip we use, the width of this, the depth um, that we're going to with the frequency. And then of course the sensation that they feel um, most clients describe it. And I feel like what I've experienced is between a tapping and a little bit of like a slight rubber band snap. So we're going to arc across the belly. Anytime we get closer to bony areas that can feel a little bit more zap as it reverberates off of there, it's not going to hurt the bone. Um, so we're always careful to arc that wand back and forth. But again, we even have um, the F15 that's sensitive enough that we use on the clitoral area, um, a ceramic tip and a smaller version of this metal tip that are used for the ED treatment. So like I said, lots of options. We usually give it a good pass or so and check in with the client before we in increase the intensity at all. How are you feeling? Okay. And now with her, I already know from having done the massager as well as the cupping that this left side feels a bit tighter to me than the right. And it's pretty remarkable. We can even feel that through the wand sometimes. It's either like some congestion or sludge through the tissues. Um, just really phenomenal results for decreasing inflammation, improving blood flow to areas. There's um, plenty of research that proves actual, actual cellular regeneration and um, blood vessel regeneration. One thing we noticed too, kind of confirmed with the wand, that same increase in tissue density, sensitivity that I was feeling with the cup, same thing I'm feeling it through the wand. So it's even diagnostic for us. And as I've been going back and forth across her abdomen, you can see there's a bit more redness on the left. And we often see that with the areas that are needing that blood flow, that, um, are responding differently to the treatment. Far more than with the cupping, you can see the redness and blood flow being brought to the surface and to these tissues, which just allows the body to just bring all those healing properties and lay down healthier collagen. Got a nice side bonus of some reduced stretch marks and tissue laxity. The ladies are loving that. No one's gonna blame it complain about bonus cosmetic benefits, right? So my absolute favorite thing to talk about, you guys might have picked up on this by now, is better sex for our clients and especially for women having improved clitoral orgasms. I am thrilled to be the only pelvic PT in Arizona offering the patented Cleavana treatment protocol. Uh, we've actually even added to it uh, with the machine that we have, we're able to use the massage function, the cupping function, as well as the actual shockwave wand. And so that treatment involves treating the perineum, entire labial area, um, up and around the clitoris, and we're actually creating healthier collagenous tissue. We're bringing more blood flow to that entire area and to the clitoris itself and the whole legs of the crura that go underneath the labia. Your clitoris is bigger than you think it is. And then we're able to use the massager at the end, but the cupping and wand also to really enhance that tissue. We've had really great results with some clients suffering from lichen sclerosis, which can often cause um, some scar tissue there. It can cause a tightening of that tissue, a lack of blood flow and sensation to that area. So we're treating those kinds of things as well as any issues women might be facing related to reaching orgasm pain or issues after childbirth. And so this is a amazing patented technology and we're so thrilled to have it here at Moment of Truth.